Hi, it's Annette. Thank you for joining. Today I'm using HipKit Club March Kits. My assignment for today was to create a mood board inspired layout. I thought I will incorporate mixed media in this layout. I was inspired by the soft pastel colored boots. I'm showing you a different way to use uh, this interesting media we get in the color kits, the Nouveau Embellishment Mousse. In February color kit we got Lavender Lilac and in the March color kit two others, the Peony Pink and the Custard Cream. And I mixed the fourth color with uh, mixing the last two, so the, uh, the Peony Pink and the Custard Cream and I got an apricot-like color. It is really pretty. This is what you see me doing right now. I just used the plastic packaging and uh, a white palette knife to mixing these colors. I am applying the mousse simply with a palette knife so that it gets nice texture. Take a bigger amount on your knife and apply it thick and loose. I like to see the texture and the marks that the palette knife leaves. You can see my son's hands to the right. He is next to me doing his homework. Uh, it is so lovely having him next to me. Well, he got some colorful splatters on his grammar book, <laughs> but he likes to be next to me. If you don't like it, just scrape it down and try it again as many times as you want. I also made some splatters just give some water to the uh, to this mousse and you get a watercolor like um, medium and this is great for splatters Leave it dry for the night and the next day you will have a wonderful background to build your layout on. This is how it looks dry. It is wonderful shine, it's beautiful. Now I have to figure out how to build my layout. These are my two lovely children nine years ago. I love this picture so much. I'm using the Pebbles and the Heidi Swap stickers and also the Ephemera. It is so much fun to mix and match collections. I like to build my layout uh, up before gluing down, but as soon as I find um, a right place for something, I just glue it. Actually, making videos have me in making quick decisions as I don't have much time. My phone gets full quickly. I use up a lot of foam dots as I create dimensions all the time. Sometimes when an ephemera is too big, I just cut it in half and uh, tuck it under another one and so that it just peeks out just a little bit. Creating layer is so much fun. Uh, it is not important to see every embellishment in whole. Peeking out under the photo is just enough.
I love using little stickers on my layout. They add so much and uh, they create lots of detail. These pebble stickers are so gorgeous, I just love them. My 40 year old daughter is next to me and she helps me deciding uh, which embellishment to use, the flamingo or the little snake or the birdie, but we decided to use the flamingo, I think. Maybe this one is the best. Uh, this fits our layout the best. I want to use the flamingo sticker as an ephemera, so I glued it on a stripe of paper and fussy cut, and this way I can just use it as a dimensional ephemera. My daughter is a big help. She has a good eye. And sometimes I ask her, is it too much? Or do we need something here? Or what do you think? And she is always honest and tells me her opinion. And this helps me sometimes. for some sentiment maybe and I think that was it the layout is finished I call it finished thank you so much for joining me I hope I inspired you in some way and you try to use this uh, interesting medium the embellishment moves in this way too I'm so so happy for your lovely comments and encouragement about my voiceover I hope you create with me next time too bye have a lovely day and stay safe.